वेलकम टू अक्षर गुरु यूट्यूब चैनल लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब Hi guys, this is the query which I asked in the group. I zoom a little bit so that you can able to watch clearly. And uh, this is the query. Okay, so we have to find the mag. Here I did an example to show you the which is the maximum current value in a range. So here is the range. Okay, here is the range. We don't know which one is the maximum occurring values. Okay, so here I did a quantity function to clarify you that DEF is the maximum occurring value. But without helper column, we have to do and we have to find which is occurring a maximum time. Right, so here is the solution which I'm going to teach you and uh, here, one of our guy in our in my group did a complex formula, but I will show you the very shortest formula. Before that, I will clear this out. Okay, right now, see, we have to find the maximum current value in a range. So what I'll do first of all, we have to count. So what I'll do, count if range this one. Right, comma, and again, count if is expecting only the single value, but I will give more than one value like this. And I will do F9 to evaluate and check whether it is showing correct or wrong. See, all are showing the current value eight. This is this is repeating eight times. Wherever 8 is there, it is repeating that many times. Other than 9, 3. See, GHI is repeating 3 times, DEF is repeating 9 times, ABC is repeating 8 times. So we have to find the DEF from here. So what I'll do here, simply I'll copy this and I will go for this. Max of this. Right. This is an array function. If it is an array function, you have to use control shift and enter. All right. Now, so what I'll do, I'll make this one as a lookup value but for the match function. Match of this comma, which I copied just now, comma zero. So I copied only the count if one. See, lookup array F9. Here, what I did, look up array F9, 9. So it is. it will look up the position where the 9 is occurring, F9. So it will pick up the first current of a value that is 9, that is position is 2. Now, this is an array function. You have to use control, shift, and enter. Now, this is the second. Now, simply I use this index function Control shift down arrow F4 comma here is it is. Now this is an array function control shift and enter. Right, DGF is occurring a maximum times. Now coming to this, one of our guys did a very complex formula. So I will do it with a simple lookup formula that is H lookup. Lookup of this a locking comma whole table the four comma second value. See, I, I'm showing you it's normal function enters, but when I drag this formula, it will give you all the cats only. So, what I'll do, I want cat call cow. So, what I'll do instead of doing two over here. Before that, I'll use this function, a rows function, O dollar four, colon O four. 
double click. What I'll do, we want the second value. So I add one, two, three, four, five. So it's simply I use this position over this type of formula over here. Simply what I'll do, rows of n dollar four, colon n four plus one. The normal function, enter, double click. So rid of zeros, control one, go to custom format. Yes, you are able to see, right. What I'll use, semicolon, semicolon. Uh, at the rate, I think. So right, let's see. Gone. Zeros are gone. If I change C to A, already data validation here. Yeah. If I use anything over here, like a corporate, and I'll go to C. Done. And if you have any query, please let me know in the comment box, or you can join in my group and ask over there for your doubts. Bye, guys. Signing off. Rajini Kant.